Hey everyone, my name is Terry G. Thanks a lot for stopping by and watching my video. If you can take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? Can you take another second and smash that like button? I really appreciate it. The name of this channel is An Alcohol Free Life. That's the name of it. On this channel, we're trying to build awareness and let people know that there is hope in recovery and there's hope from recovering from this awful disease of alcoholism. If you're thinking on quitting or you're on your journey of recovery, this is the channel for you. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments below, okay? Just leave them in the comments below. And again, thanks a lot for stopping by. Just a little sidebar before I get into the video is that if you're experiencing any of these things that I'm talking about, the negative things sort of deal, go and see your doctor if you're experiencing long term, okay? I am just an alcoholic, I'm not a psychiatrist, a psychologist, a medical doctor. I'm just sharing my experience, strength and hope with other people on YouTube to build awareness. But if you're feeling these feelings long term, by all means, go and seek help. Don't take any advice off any YouTube channels. Always see a medical doctor or somebody who specializes in the problem that you're experiencing, okay? That's just a general awareness thing I just wanna point out before I stop the video. Start the video, not stop the video, start the video. And what this video is about, is about something that I used to experience a lot of when I drank. And what it was, was the feeling of feeling sad after I drank. The next day, I'd go out on a Saturday night, and the next day, I always felt sad or depressed. And I always thought it was generally, you know, generally the things I did. Sometimes I got drunk and I got in a fight with people. I got dumped by my girlfriend. Some terrible things happened to me while I drank. A lot of terrible things did happen to me in my drinking career, but I associated that to the way I felt. Like I feel sad and I feel depressed. But there's another reason why we feel sad and depressed. You know, we can feel those feelings from being such a jerk in our drinking, you know, getting in a fight and that. But there's another reason why we can feel sadness or a feeling of depression for maybe a day or two or maybe even three days after we drank, okay? And the, the reason is for that, and it's very, very true what I'm telling you, is that alcohol in itself is a depressant. A lot of us who drink long term often say we feel sad or we feel depressed. And the reason is, if you're a daily drinker like I was, you will probably be in a state of sadness or depression the next day. So for myself, I was always feeling depressed all the time while I drank. And the reason for this is because alcohol is a depressant. It's just simply a depressant. What it does, it affects the happy chemicals in our mind. It really does. And those chemicals are the serotonin, the happy serotonins and the endorphins in our mind. The alcohol goes to that area in our mind and it triggers those areas in a depression way. So we feel sad and we feel depressed after we drink. Alcohol does that. It can cause people to feel severely depressed and to feel severely sad. So and sometimes after we quit drinking, I know for myself, it took a number of days and weeks for me to really start feeling better about life in general. Just physically better, not so depressed, not so heavy, and not so sad because the brain had to sort of reset itself. The endorphins, the serotonin, the way I thought, how to reset itself because I drank for long periods of time every day for many years. So I felt really depressed and really sad after I quit drinking. But that part of my brain, that part of my emotions, and I started feeling joy, I started feeling happiness again, and I even started to laugh after a few weeks of being sober. I really did. I hung around, started going to meetings, hanging around guys, and things started to reset itself. And that, that feeling of sadness, that feeling of depression left me over time and it'll do the same for you. But like I said in the beginning of this video, if you're experiencing depression or sadness for long periods of time after drinking, after stopping drinking, you might wanna go and seek medical help, okay? You might wanna do that because it will help you. Not all of it is related to our drinking. A lot of times people drink because of underlying problems such as anxiety, depression, 
past traumas. So go and seek some help, okay? Don't take this video as gospel, but you will feel better once you quit, once you quit drinking. And the reason you feel sad and depressed is direct result from the alcohol. It plays around with our mind. It screws up our mind. It really, really does, okay? Thanks a lot for stopping by. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, leave a comment below and let me know that. Let me know that. If there's any topics that you want me to talk about, let me know that too. But all he is, have a great day of your sobriety. If your alcohol is, is, is harming you, quit drinking one day at a time. Give it some try. Give it a try, okay? Because there's a great life after sobriety. There, I mean, after drinking, there's a great life. There really, really is, okay? My name is Terry G. This is an alcohol-free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Just remember, together we are strong. Together we can stay sober much, much easier, okay? I'll see you next week. Thanks a lot for stopping by. Stay safe. Stay sober. God bless. Over and out. Ciao for now.